Magandang araw po sa inyo po lahat at uh, ganoon din po sa ating po mga nanonood ngayon po ay kami po mga bati sa inyo ng magandang araw kahit saan man po kayo uh, panig ng mundo. Kami po nagpapasalamat sa Panginoon for giving us an opportunity to once again to share to you the love of God and His forgiveness. And also we would like to thank uh, Dr. Joseph Nasaralia for giving us an opportunity as well to be Uh, seated here in his studio at uh, kami ay nagbibigay ng uh, kaliwanagan sa mga taong nangangailangan ng salita ng Panginoon. Maraming maraming salamat. At ngay- ngayon po mga kapatid, ang uh, aming pong uh, gustong i-discuss po sa inyo and I just want to share to you is about love and relationship. Now, ano po ba ang pag-ibig? Paano po tayo mamimili ng taong ating pong mamahalin? Ang lahat po ba ng pakiramdam na pag-ibig ay tama? Ang atin po bang nararamdaman sa kapwa po natin na nais po nating maging, pang, uh, uh, maging uh, kasama sa atin uh, panghanap, uh, pang, uh, panghabang buhay, ay ito po ba ay ang tamang tao na ibinibigay ng Panginoon? Paano natin malalaman na ang taong ito ay tamang tao para sa akin? Maging, manlalaki, maging lalaki man kayo o maging babae, palagay ko po mga kapatid, na ito po ang inyo pong mga katanungan sa buhay. Kasama ko po ngayon si Brother Arthur Omania at uh, Sister Vanna na magsishare po sila sa atin ng kanilang mga experiences na magbibigay sa atin ng konting aral. Alam po ninyo, magandang uh, i-interviewin po mga kapatid yung mga kabataan na uh, katulad po nila because they are experiencing some kind of a, of a, uh, a love toward the uh, opposite sex. At uh, ito po ba ay... Uh, ito po bang kanilang mga naramdaman ay uh, tama at uh, ito po ba ay nagbibigay ng aral din po sa kanilang mga buhay? Tanungin po muna natin si Brother Arthur. So bago po yan ay nais ko pong basahin po sa inyo ang 1 Corinthians chapter 13. At tinihiling ko po si Brother Arthur to read to us 1 Corinthians chapter 13 verses 4 hanggang 8. Sige nga, Brother Arthur. Love is patient and kind. Mm-hmm. Love is not jealous or boastful or proud or rude. It does not demand its own way. It is not irritable and it keeps no record of being wronged. It does not rejoice about injustice but rejoices whenever the truth wins out. Love never gives up, never loses faith is always hopeful and endures through every circumstance. Prophecy and speaking in unknown languages and special knowledge will become useless, but love will last forever. Amen! Love will last forever. Ako po'y naniniwala, mga kapatid, na ang pagmamahal po natin sa ating kapwa, it should last forever. At yung pagmamahal ng Diyos ay binibigay sa atin, it is, it is lasting, mga kapatid. Now, I would like to ask past, uh, Brother Arthur, have you experienced to love? Uh, in some way po, po. Uh-huh. At uh, kay ikaw ba ay uh, naramdaman mo ba na na min, nagmahal ka ba sa isang uh, sa isang babae na iniisip mo na at ipinanalangin mo na sana po Panginoon ito na po ang aking mapapangasawa. Have you seen that person in your life? Ah uh, po. <laughs> Nakita ko po even before po pero uh-huh. uh, in the end po hindi po yun yung dalangin sa akin ng Panginoon pero That's right. Alam po, alam niyo, uh, alam mo, uh, Brother Arthur. Sometimes our eyes is very deceiving, right? So minsan nakakakita po tayo ng ating magugustuhan sa buhay. So balit uh, hindi pala ito ang kalooban mm-hmm. ng Dios sa iyong buhay. Oh, wow. But sometimes our our physical uh, physical feeling uh, or y- yung ating panini- pantingin sa tao ay parang perfectong mm-hmm. perfecto until we know we know each other until yet you know that person yeah. from the inside out so in another word uh, brother arthur uh, the love that we should that we should have is the love to that inner person inner person right and hindi doon sa outer person mm-hmm. correct as yes, sister vana yes po then how would you how would you know if that person is the right person for you sister vana um i I believe you would know if the person is right for you when um, you have peace in mm-hmm. your heart na 
and you're comfortable with the person. That's um, an undertaking. He makes a lot of effort, or mm. he's very consistent, mm. and um, he actually pulls through with words. Mm. <laughs> you said about very consistent. Napaka importante pa nga kapatid ang consistency sa relationship. Hindi yung parang alo na na umaakyat, bumababa, pumupunta ron at babalik uli, ano? So it should be consistent. Mm -hmm. Kung halimbawa consistent siya in a in a certain in a certain uh, way of relating to you, it should be it should be in a positive way as well, ano? Mm -hmm. uh, napaka importante Sister Bana na malaman natin kung yung ating uh, Uh, minamahal sa buhay or you're we're looking forward to that person I, it is the right person for you mm -hmm. something na you, they, 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 they need to also mm -hmm. show sacrifices right brother Arthur uh -huh. have you experienced that na ikaw ay uh, uh, willing to sacrifice for that person that you you want to marry someday uh, yun po yung time po and uh -oh. dumating rin po sa point na ginastusan rin uh -oh. and Nag-effort. Oo. Pero, makikita nyo po talaga yung may ibabase nyo po doon sa 1 Corinthians 13. Mm -hmm. yung, ano, mm -hmm. yung personality po ng tao na yun. Mm -hmm. Yung, kumbaga, yung true love mm -hmm. na meron kayo. If mm -hmm. you base it doon sa verse. Mm -hmm. na pag nakilala nyo na siya ng lubusan. Kasi pagka first pagka first impression pa lang po infatuation meaning mm, mm. yung nakikita niyo lang yung panglabas niya mm, pero mm. ano eventually doon na kayo doon na kayo nagkakaalaman mm, mm, ng, ano pag uh, pagka once na yung effort is nagdie down or mm. ano or consistent pa rin mm, it really depends po eh kung ano yeah yeah maganda yung sinabi mo brother Arthur that your basis is the scriptures no mm -hmm. love is kind that's not rude that's not envy that's not jealous no so yung mga bagay na ganun dapat yun ating yun ang ating basihan, basihan. na ang isa sa mga ang isa sa mga uh, palagay ko na dapat nating makita sa kapwa natin na gusto nating mapangasawa yung unselfishness Mm -hmm. Yung hindi siya selfish, hindi yung pang sarili lamang. Doon nasisira ang relationship, uh, Sister Bana, na kung halimbawa uh, na ang uh, boyfriend mo or yung, yung, yung kaibigan mo na nandiligaw sa'yo, nakikita mo na na puro pang sarili na lamang niya ang kanyang inaatupag at uh, yung feeling lamang niya ang kanyang, uh, ang kanyang uh, inaalagaan, ay uh, palagay ko hindi pa ito yung tamang person na pepede mong mapangasawa. What do you think about that, uh, Sister Van? Yeah, base nga po sa scripture na binasa po ni Arthur, it says, a love does not demand its own way. Mm -hmm. So, um, Um, parang <coughs> hindi dapat po yung, kalo, yung laging kalooban niya yung nasusunod, mm -hmm. kundi um, it has to be fair, it has mm -hmm. to be parang respectful towards the other person too, if, mm -hmm. if she agrees or not. Mm -hmm. um, it's supposed to be like a mutual understanding na That's right. dapat na pag-uusapan bago to make, before making a decision. That's correct. Yeah. And besides, kung halimbawa nanliligaw pa labang sa'yo, no? ay... Uh, very demanding na doon sa mga bagay-bagay. Isa yan sa mga no-no sign, mm. right? Na hindi mo pepeding maging uh, boyfriend or girlfriend. Maaari ang isang tao na ito ay maaari mong maging matalik na kaibigan. Mm -hmm. Something like it's very confusing uh, for both uh, opposite sex. Na kapag naging uh, clo very close friends sila, akala nila ay pepeding na silang... Uh, Uh, they could be a uh, husband and wife someday, mm -hmm. right? Pero it, ito ang isang mala, mala, uh, malaking uh, pagkakamali ng isang uh, uh, couple na nag-aasawa uh, na akala nila ay, uh, ay magiging compatible sila. Mm -hmm. There are many kinds of love, mga kapatid. And one of them is the Peleo love. Right? Mm -hmm. The Peleo love is a friendship love. Friendship. Itong Peleo love is, a, is also a true love. It is also a true love in the level of friendship, right? But uh, there is also what we call uh, agape love. Agape love is a godly love. It is the love of God bestowed upon us. At uh, ito rin po nire-require po sa atin ng ating Panginoon on how to love God with all of our heart, soul, and mind. And also, mga kapatid, if we could also do an agape love to our, to our partner, to our uh, future husband, future wife, it's also a good thing. Mm -hmm. 
because agape love is it it it, it, it consists uh, everything that requires for love hmm. kaya napaka importante kapatid na tayo ay uh, Uh, ta tayo ay uh, willing to sacrifice because agape love is a uh, sacrificial love. Mm -hmm. All right? Uh, Sister Bana, uh, can I ask you about uh, your, uh, a, li a little bit personal, ano? Have you fallen in love? I believe I have fallen in love. Uh -huh. I was in a relationship for seven years. Mm -hmm. um, I can say I've fallen in love because I've given it my all. Mm -hmm. Like in a relationship where I... Put him first. Mm. Um, I served, parang I served him in a way that because when I get into a relationship, po, hindi mm -hmm. po yung, I don't want to be in a relationship just to be in a relationship. Mm -hmm. I want to be in a relationship for marriage. Oh. So, parang <clears throat> I really, yung parang pinagsilbihan na mm. you you listen, mm -hmm. you ad, you advise, you understand. Mm -hmm. um, Parang you you put your trust mm -hmm. and you hope mm -hmm. na kahit if even though the person fails mm -hmm. you both try to work it out mm -hmm. like it never like I wouldn't want to give up just mm -hmm. because we have a problem. Mm -hmm. um, That's so. a good relationship no? uh, toward him. Uh, na binibigay mo sa kanya. Mm -hmm. uh, my our advice also, uh, Sister Bana. Uh, those person na katulad mo, no? na kailangan din nating mahalin ang ating mga sarili. Right? Sometimes, may nagkakaroon tayo ng relationship with the opposite sex, but uh, yung kanilang pagmamahal ay hindi kasi taas ang pagmamahal na binibigay mo sa kanya. Mm. Right? Now, uh, minsan, makakapag-isip din tayo, mga kapatid, at kailangan tayong mag-isip. That is this person uh, is just a recipient of my love and never, never uh, give back to me the love that I uh, deserve also from him as, uh, as a boyfriend. Oh, of course, mag-iisip tayo, I, I, I really need to uh, reserve the love for myself as well. Right? Na kinakailangan na uh, isipin din po natin ang ating kinabukasan mm. na maaring itong tao na ito ay uh, nagpapakita na ng sign that uh, he is not the right person for you. Mm -hmm. Like Sister mm -hmm. Bana? Yeah, and I, I actually learned a lesson from mm -hmm. that book. Mm -hmm. um, every failed relationship, there's always a lesson. Mm -hmm. um, and... I, in every relationship I've been to or been with, um, there's always something mm -mm. that you get from it. Mm -mm. Yes, po. Yeah, so I that's... learned self-value, self-love, mm. um, putting yourself first. Like, how can you love someone without loving yourself that's first? That's correct. That's yeah. correct. And the, 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 the standard of, uh, of God uh, to love that, that person is as you love yourself. Mm -hmm. yun, ang, yun ang utos sa atin ng Panginoon, Brother Arthur, right? Okay. So I believe, Brother Arthur, you are also experienced that kind of experience as Bana de, does. Mm -hmm. Na nagmahal ka, subalit hindi siya nagbalik ng pagmamahal mm -hmm. ng sapat doon sa ibinibigay mong pagmamahal okay. din sa kanya. Now, uh, we also need to love in truth. Yung merong katotohanan. Mm -hmm. Ito pang aking pagmamahal ay makatotohanan sa uh, taong ito. Uh, yung tao ba na aking minamahal ay ganun din na nagmamahal sa akin. Are we compatible uh, with, uh, with most ev uh, mostly, uh, everything na maaring maging maganda ang aming situation? Now, in my, in, in, in my, uh, in, in my um, uh, advice to many uh, singles, Uh, I advise them to uh, test that person. Mm -hmm. Kina kailangan itest kapatid. Uh, kapang kayo po ay isang babae na nililigawan. Uh, don't make them choose you. Choose you. Choose them. Kailangan you test each person na nililigaw sa inyo. And I believe Brother Arthur will can can speak uh, for himself. Na na kina na si Brother Arthur kapag na, pag uh, ang isang lalaki, no? Ang isang lalaki kapag uh, naliligaw. Of course, we give our best, mm -hmm. right? How did you do? Uh, uh, Papano mo ginawa yun na kapatid? na ikaw ay naligaw. Ayun uh, po. Uh, typical na po sa laki yung flowery words. Uh -huh. And yung ano, time. <laughs> siguro yung... 
<laughs> yung, yun nga yung sinasabi natin pambobola pero in reality hindi yun hindi dapat po yung basihan natin dahil oh hindi dapat basihan ng babae yun basihan ng babae oh, yun oh, yeah yung ang basihan po dapat diyan yung tunay na ugali ng lalaki That's good. from po, the inside from out from the inside out oh. and yung nga po based on the scriptures kung nami-meet ba niya yung standards na yun sa scriptures na love doesn't boast or Love is not rude, uh-huh. all that. Kasi sa panahon po ngayon, marami pong mga lalaki na ano eh, hindi, na, hindi nasusunod yung ganang ano eh, That's true, that's true. Guidelines dun sa 1 Corinthians 13. Hindi uh-huh. na, hindi na, hindi na pa follow po yan uh-huh. eh. Oo nga eh. Kaya marami pong mga failed relationships. Kaya, yan, ano. uh, kaya napakaganda na alam natin ang Bible. Right, mm. Sister Vanna? Yes po, tama yan. Oh, Kasi sabi nga nila, they use pambobola. So, <laughs> you have to really know if their love is true. So, you have to uh-huh. test them what uh-huh. they say. Mm-hmm. If it actually match um, yung sinasabi nila, minsan na pambobola is, um, ikaw lang, wala ng uh-huh. iba. Uh-huh. So, <laughs> Sometimes it may take you a while to decide po, di ba? So, uh, tinan mo kung how patient they are in waiting. Mm, yeah. Kaya kailangan nyo pa yung pag-pray. Kung that's that's right. Kung talaga yung sinasabi niya o hindi. <laughs> <laughs> so, kailangan nating itest, right, uh, Sister Ivana? Yes. At nanggaling na rin si kay Brother Arthur. <laughs> Ma, may mga, may, may halong konting words. flowery, <laughs> flowery <laughs> words. words, right? Na nag, uh, uh, para, mm. para naman, uh, para naman makapagbigay uh, na kasiyahan mm-hmm. sa mga, ito ay normal, kapatid. Okay. No? Normal dyan sa isang manliligaw. Of course, kung ikaw ay manliligaw at magsasalita ka ng mga pangit, ay right ay, there wala. and then, wala na eh. Apo. Right? Wala Kaya na. piling-pili yung mga, sa mga, piling-pili yung mga uh, words na ating mm. sinasabi. sinasabi. Now, We have to test, sabi nga ni Sister Vanna. Mm-hmm. Uh, is his words matches his heart? Mm-hmm. Matches his attitude? Kailangan mag-match yan, Sister Vanna, mm-hmm. eh, right? Yung uh, heart, or we can say attitude, character, and words. Mm-hmm. Pag hindi nagmamatch yung tatlo na yun, kapatid, uh, there is something uh, hidden in Apo. his heart. What do, you say, uh, what, what, what do you say about uh, that, uh, Sister Vanna? Um... Hindi po tugma, hindi po connected. Hindi so connected. What say. Uh-huh. Yeah, yung parang tama po naman. Um, pero um, I, I can be guilty of that, Pastor. Mm-hmm. Like, dahil lang ba, minsan nag, nagkukulang ka sa action mo. Mm-hmm. It doesn't, I mean, you say something and you mm-hmm. don't mm-hmm. do, you don't act on it. Mm-hmm. But not so much. Um, hindi naman po major, but mm-hmm. it, dahil lang po ba nagkulang ka sa isa? Does it mean? Well, uh, hindi lamang doon sa mga maliliit na, sa, sa maliit na bagay na gano'n. If that person, now listen to this mga kapatid, if your boyfriend or girlfriend uh, knows to admit uh, her mistakes or fault, I think that is also a good sign. Mm-hmm. Hindi nagkakamali naman talaga lahat ng tao. We are not looking for a number 100% perfect person, correct? Mm-hmm. But if that person knows how to admit his uh, mistakes, uh, uh, humble enough to say sorry, mm-hmm. I believe that person is a good person for you. Uh, what I was saying, na kinakailangan natin itest, uh, let's say for example, itest natin yung kanyang patient. Mm-hmm. Right? Huwag mo sagutin yung tawag niya. Try it. Ayun. Let's say, tumatawag ito person na ito. Tawag ng tawag. Huwag mo sagutin. Itest natin yung patient. Tingnan natin kung ano ang kanyang attitude. And then, uh, this is my advice sa mga single. Write it down. <laughs> no? Write mm-hmm. down. The first page, I tested your patient. Mm-hmm. This is what, uh, what I did, and this is uh, the result. And then, conclusion, naging mainit ang ulo mo, at uh, sumigaw ka sa akin, at uh, hindi mo na ako pinansin. Right? <laughs> mga ganong conclusion. Uh... Or, or, kung maganda naman ang conclusion, put it down. Mm-hmm. Write it down. You are very patient. Mm-hmm. And it's still loving. And uh, you are still soft to me. Na, mm. na kahit na kahit na hindi kita sinasagot, you are yes. always under you you you, you ano, uh, you are always understanding sa lahat ng mga bagay. Pero po pastor, marami rin mga eventually nagbabago rin yung approach nila. Eh siyempre, yung... i- i- 'yun ang i- 'yun ang ibibigay mo sa kanya. Okay. 'Yun ang ibibigay mo sa kanyang point. Mm-hmm. So how are you going to correct this? Mm-hmm. If I'm going to marry you, How are you going to correct this? Mm-hmm. Kasi, ah, ito ang mga bagay na ayaw ko. Mm-hmm. 
Eh, mm. paano kung halimbawa nga uh, mag-asawa na tayo mm. and you, you keep doing this, magkakagulo tayo. Mm -hmm. Yeah, at saka it's very important din siguro po sa, sa atin oh. na very truthful, very mm -hmm. open po sa na, nararamdaman. Kasi paano, mm. paano malalaman ng isang tao na hindi mo gusto yung ganun na ugali niya kung hindi ka magsasabi, di ba po? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So it's very communication po. Communication. That's very important. Maraming mga bagay na pwede mong itens, Sister Vanna. Pwede mong itens yung kanyang uh, love, Ipepede mong uh, ites yung kanyang how how he handles mm. finances. Ah, uh, pepede mong ites yung uh, yung uh, yung kanyang mga attitude. Marami tayong mga attitude mm. sa buhay na kailangan nating malaman. Mm -hmm. uh, can he can he sacrifice these things for this relationship? Marami pong mga bagay na kailangan po natin ites. And I suggest that make a diary about that. Mm -hmm. uh, so that at the end of your at the end of the day at uh, magdi decide na kayo na mag, mag, uh, mag, magsasama o kaya naman magpapakasal. Eh, before you do that, let us deal with this situation first. Mm -hmm. Right? If, you're not, uh, if you cannot deal with this situation, so kahit na mahal kita, mm -hmm. for the sake of my family, for the sake of our future children, I will not marry you. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. Kasi hindi magiging maganda kung hindi mo aalisin yung iyong paninigarilyo, hindi mo aalisin yung iyong pagsusugal, kung hindi mo aalisin yung pagbumura mo, eh, I'm sorry, it is not the person that I'm looking for. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. So, of course, tayo ay marunong magmahal. At marunong tayo magpatawan at napipwede tayo maghintay ng pagbabago. We're expecting. Yeah. But don't marry a person expecting that person that will change after your marriage. Mm -hmm. no? yeah. Huwag niyo pong gagawin yon. Yeah. Marami pong nagkakamali doon. Sabi nga po nila, um, you shouldn't change a person they should change themselves for you because they love you. Parang may ganun po. Na, that, that's nasa, right. That's nasabi. right. They, kailangan magbago muna eh. Yeah. And as, as a Christian, you need to introduce to, to him, kung hindi pa siya Kristiyano, uh, at uh, na fall in love ka sa isang hindi Kristiyano, minsan madalas mo nagkakaroon ng mga ganun, ano? Uh, the first requirement is the Lord. Yes. Kung hindi siya marunong magmahal sa Diyos, hindi rin siya, hindi rin niya masasabing marunong siya magmahal sa kapwa mm. niya. Mm. Right? So, yan ang ating basihan na Sister Vanna. Mm -hmm. And another thing, kung hindi siya nagsiserve sa Panginoon, how could he serve the family? Mm -hmm. Right? Napaka-importante mga kapatid as a single ay uh, matuto po tayong uh, pumili ng ating pong mga pangasawa. Uh, maging lalaki man po tayo o maging babae, napakahalaga po mga kapatid that that person na mapapangasawa mo, it meets your own standard and the standard of the Lord. Dahil kapag nagpangasawa po kayo ng isang uh, mahilig maglaro ng games at inaabot ng alas 4 ng umaga na nasa computer, ang napangasawa nyo rin po yung computer. Na po? <laughs> yung game na kanyang ginagawa. Kung uh, ang, napang, ang inyo pong boyfriend na mapapangasawa ninyo ay uh, mahilig sa barkada, pati barkada po nila napasama doon sa inyong pinakasalan. You have to understand that you cannot change that person after you get married. You have to tell them na magbago muna. Ito muna ng tao na ito ang uh, magbago bago magpakasal. Right? Mm -hmm. What are you going to uh, uh, give? Uh, can you give an advice, uh, Brother Arthur, para doon sa mga uh, naghahanap ng mapapangasawa? Ayan po. Uh, Unang-una po sa lahat, ipag-pray niyo po muna. That's right. Yung person na yon kung yun po ba ang binibigay sa inyo ni Lord. And mm -hmm. Suriin po mabuti, kilatisin. Oh. And <laughs> lagi po i-base sa scriptures po yung ano, uh, yung basis po ng pagpili ng Amen. tabang tao na Amen. para sa inyo. Amen. Amen. Mr. Silvana? Uh, nasabi na po ni Arthur lahat, yun mm. po. Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, yun nga po, be, be discerning sa yeah. tao. Um, mm. You have to really see how he acts around mm. you, not mm. only around you, but around mm. people as well. Yeah. Kasi mag magkaiba po yung trato sa iyo, like that's to other right, people. That's right, that's right. Now, an an another advice uh, coming from me, mga kapatid, uh, make sure that that person that you want to marry, they love his own family. Mm -hmm. He respect his family, his siblings, his parents. Kung hindi siya marunong mag-respect sa kanilang, uh, kanilang magulang, how could he respect his own family, mm -hmm. right? So, napakalaga po, mga kapatid, na maging maingat sa pagpili 
ng inyong pong mapapangasawa. At uh, I would like to ask um, uh, Sister um, uh, Vanna to, to close us with a prayer para ipag-pray po yung mga taong nalilito sa oras na ito. Right? Okay, sige, <laughs> yeah. Sister Vanna. Okay, dear Heavenly Father, Lord, um, maraming maraming salamat po sa aming discussion today, Lord God. Thank Amen. you for being in the midst of us, Lord. Yes, Lord. Um, I just pray, Lord God, for those people who are um, in love or mm -hmm. who are in a relationship, Lord God. Um, I pray that you would uh, really guide their heart, Lord <coughs> God, and um, inaangat po namin yung mga... Uh, puso decision nila sa inyo, Lord, that they shouldn't um, decide on based on emotions, Lord, mm -hmm. but um, din po sa pagmamahal at uh, mga actions po ng kanilang partner, Lord, um, sa mga uh, hindi po nakaalam nakaala sa inyo, Lord God, um, I just want to lift them up to you, Lord, na um, they would come they would come near you, draw near to you, mm -hmm. Lord, um, uh, to know what what God, what love is, because you are love, God. God yes, is Lord. love. Um, so I, we just want to thank you, Lord God, for this conversation, Lord. Mm -hmm. um, we praise you, we honor you in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Nawa Amen. po, mga kapatid, na pagpala po kayo ng Panginoon sa discussion na ito, pagpalawi na wa po kayo muli ng Panginoon, nang higit pa sa inyo pong hinihiling. God bless you. Amen.